Hello guys, it's been a bit. I'm going to talk quietly because the babies are currently napping. Jordan's in a meeting and I have like a moment of quiet that I thought I would kick off the video with. So today's going to be like halfway vlog, halfway haul. I feel like every time I try to vlog, something comes up that makes it difficult. Either like kids are nuts, my battery dies, whatever it might be. So I'm gonna see how much I can do today. Um, I do have a big fall fashion haul, which I'm super excited about. You guys know I'm like a diehard summer girl. Like I don't want summer to ever end, but this year I'm actually feeling a little bit excited for fall. I'm ready for some changes. So I figured I'd share that and then give you guys just some updates on what we've been up to. I think in my last video, we were preparing to go to Ohio for our trip there. We went for 10 days to our hometown and it was so much fun it was so nice it was the first time we were on a plane ride with the babies and with all four kids so it was like a big milestone for us as parents i feel like and it actually went pretty smooth all things considered and then this week we are actually going to take another plane ride and we're going out of town again to go to texas to see my in-laws so i'm preparing for that i thought i would pack a little bit with you guys in today's vlog the boys started school last week too so it's just been like a super chaotic busy time but it's been good like i said i feel like we're all ready for like a little bit more structure a little bit more routine a new season some changes around the house and in our daily routine you know all that good stuff i feel like i'm losing my voice a little bit i don't know why but <laughs> hopefully i'm able to talk through most of this video and yeah that's it for now i'll check in in a little bit all right guys it's hot but we are also getting in the fall spirit over here so put this back here fake it till i make it and pretend like it's not 80 something degrees outside but anyway so as you can tell i have a huge haul today from walmart this video is sponsored by walmart you guys know i love them for so many things i showed a kids back to school haul with them this season and today i have so many good fall fashion finds i'm not exaggerating i'm not just saying this i struggle to get in the fall spirit every single year because right when fall hits everyone else is when summertime seems to hit us in socal we finally have hot weather tourists are gone like we are able to soak up summer however everyone is getting in the fall spirit and i struggle to get in the fall spirit typically every year but this haul got me so excited for fall like i'm literally i'm planning on dyeing my hair a little darker i'm in the mood for pumpkin spice i found the cutest things at walmart everything is super affordable everything is super accessible if you didn't know in the walmart app you can shop for not only pickup which is one of my favorite things to do you can get same day order pickup and go to the store and it's ready for you they'll bring it out to your car or you can also do same day delivery i have the walmart plus subscription that helps me save on delivery fees but even if you don't you can do same day delivery and have everything to you within a few hours even if you don't do same day delivery, they have so many like next day delivery items or two day delivery items. Walmart.com is one of the fastest shippers <laughs> and I shop a lot. I order a lot online and I'm able to get things super quick from them. So as you can see, I have a bunch of goodies to show you guys today. I'll try not to ramble too much, but I'm really excited for everything. And then I was going to do a bit of a try on haul, but I'm not going to lie. It's a little tricky right now with the babies and with our house <laughs> being kind of a mess but i am going to put together a reel with outfit ideas so everything i show in today's video i'm gonna have in the try on reel with a bunch of different outfits and combinations of how i'm styling them so head over to my instagram to see that and you can see how everything fits me there first and foremost oh, i tried this on earlier absolutely love it this vest i got same day delivery like the same day i ordered it i got it delivered to my house a few hours later faux leather sherpa vest this thing is so like 70s chic to me it has pockets it's the perfect layer to feel like you're getting in the fall spirit i believe they also had it in black but it just makes me so happy i feel straight out of that 70s show and it's actually really comfortable and lightweight but it's just like so trendy and fun for fall. I have a lot of clothes and I did not have anything like that. So it made me excited. I got two hats delivered. So I especially love stuff like this for getting in the fall, like spirit and style when it is hot outside because you can wear, you know, something that feels summery on the body and then put this on and it feels a little bit more fall, like with some boots and stuff like that. I feel like I'm always in a hat like this at the pumpkin patch, you know? 
Also, this hat is really fun. So this is like a twist on your typical dad hat or baseball style hat because it has the faux leather bill right there. I think that's so fun. I couldn't decide between this color or they also had it in black and it was like a charcoal up here and then a black bill. I might go back and get it. It was super affordable and this was another same day delivery. Things like pickup or school events, this would be such a good one for like comfort but style too. I also have some really cute shoes, but I'm gonna save all the shoes together because they are mind blowing. We have some gold dangly earrings. They had a ton of gold jewelry that I loved at walmart.com. I believe I got some rings and stuff too. I feel like this is the largest box I've ever received <laughs> from online shopping at like, I'll recycle all this later. Shoes, two more pairs of shoes. I'm telling you guys, I found so many good things. <laughs> Okay, so I'll continue on the dainty jewelry trying to show you what else I got there. So these are some rings, which is great because I'm a little a little bare today. I only have two rings on, so I need to add more. Oh my gosh, be smarter than the envelope, Olivia. This cross style, a little X action with rhinestones. Love that. Good little dainty every day. And then this one was kind of fun. So one of my best friends is getting married next month, which is a whole update I'll have to chat about in this vlog too, because we are going to the wedding, we're traveling with the girls, and they're gonna be flower girls in it, which I'm so excited about. But anyways, so my friend loves croissants. It's like one of her claim, claim to fame that we always talk about. And so I found this croissant inspired ring at walmart and how fun is that so i thought i would wear it because i'm going to be in the wedding as i walk the girls down the aisle so i thought i would wear that as like a little nod to her so one of the trends for fall that i keep seeing everywhere is like preppy style which is so funny to me because i went to private school for a very long time growing up i had like catholic school uniforms and i feel like it's all coming back now i wish i had held on to my uniforms from high school you know so this one is also from the brand no boundaries and this is just a cute little pleated skirt i will probably wear some shorts underneath it to be honest like some spandex shorts or something like that but i love how simple it looks i feel like with some high boots this would be really, really cute. And like a chunky oversized cardigan or something like that. Another classic tee, this one in this mocha color. This, this is super stretchy and like really soft and smooth feeling. Should have said this earlier, but also everything I'm showing, I'll have linked in the description box down below. As always, you can always find all everything I can find. I link in the description box, but especially from this haul, everything will be linked down there. This was a really cool piece that I liked a lot. It's like sweatpants, but a skirt. It's a midi skirt that has cargo pockets on the side. I thought this with that t-shirt would be super sleek and chic. I don't usually see like sweatpant material skirts, but I thought that was really fun and will be like a way to stay comfy. Again, for like drop off or whatever, it'll be a way to stay comfy and look put together, but you're literally wearing sweatpants and then this is another midi skirt that is actually i'm just now realizing pretty much the exact same thing but it's in this oh okay sorry i had to pause for a second because lola's got a little bit of separation anxiety and anytime she sees me it's all over so anyways she's comfy upstairs now with jordan and soleil all is good so Continuing with the haul. This skirt, I realized is pretty much the same as that sweatpant one, except it's this like cargo material, your typical denim material. This one is another like maxi style. I feel like this style with the slit in the front and some tall boots is so cute or some Western boots, so cute for fall. I love that and you know I love my creams and neutrals. I really did a lot of pops of color this summer and spring and then I'm realizing just now as I'm doing this haul that I'm kind of back in the neutrals game in this haul, which is fine, I like it. I also got these jeans that are like a wide leg. They're really comfortable. They're a little bit big on, big on me. I probably should have sized down, but they'll be like a good comfy everyday jean. And for those of you who like something like that, but you do not like distressing, these would be a good fit for you because there's no holes or anything like that. I think what would be really cute to pair with the jeans would be this trench. So I have been on the hunt for the, like a great trench jacket for a little bit now. I've ordered a couple. I really wanted a cropped one because I feel like that's more practical for my day to day. I've struggled to find a good one that's like good quality, but this one, you guys, Walmart does it again. 
This one is such good quality and at such an affordable price. It's cropped, it's trendy, it's like a breathable trench jacket. Like I want a jacket like this that's good for the transitions of summer to fall. That's not too heavy, especially in our California climate, but just in general, like this is such a cute, I'm so excited about this piece, so excited. And I think it will look really cute with jeans like that. Put that with the dad hat I got, like perfection. Okay, so let's move on to shoes, which are the cause for all of these big boxes. I was just talking about all the neutrals in this haul. Well, let me prove myself wrong because I have some pops of red here. These actually look very Dorothy-like, which I think is gonna be my Halloween costume. So maybe I'll just wear these instead of get the heels that I was gonna order. But anyways, so I really like this mesh flat trend. Also, can I give a shout out to Walmart for all of the trends? Like there are so many trendy, unique pieces in this haul and on their website. I was so excited to get my hands on all of these things. But these are really fun because they're that mesh, like kind of sheer flat style which again, really breathable and lightweight going from summer to fall. They had a couple different colors of these, but I just thought the red was really fun. I don't have anything like that. And it adds a bit of color to all of the neutral outfits that I got. So got some flats, but then these ones, you guys. So I have become a Swifty this year. <laughs> and if I had gone to her concert, which is like one of my biggest regrets. But if I had gone to her concert, I would have worn a shoe like this. These boots are so stunning and they're so comfortable and they are also really great quality. And I'm not just saying that, but like $40, $40 from Madden NYC, which is Steve Madden's line. They also had additional colors of these, but I'm just like obsessed with the rhinestone detailing. They look so good on I cannot wait to wear these all fall long. They are just such such a fun, fun boot. I'm obsessed. I have so many pairs of cowboy boots now. Okay, speaking of, this style is a little bit different, but equally as stunning. Oh my gosh, how beautiful. These look like an espresso martini in shoe form. Look how gorgeous those are. These are the short boots that I'm going to try with all of those skirts with the slits in front of them. I just think these are so fun, so gorgeous. Also by Madden NYC. Oh my gosh, these are going to be so fun for every every little occasion under the sun. I've been really trying to push my style. I know it doesn't look like it in this setting right now, but I've been having fun dressing up more. And like when I go for like girls nights or just, you know, events with the kids, like I'm trying to stop saving all of the cute outfits for that special occasion and just start wearing all the cute things that I've been holding off on, you know? Like I want to just start feeling better in the day to day. So that's kind of what this haul was a bit about for me too, is like getting all of the really fun, fashionable things that I'm going to incorporate into my daily style. But just speaking of, you guys will probably laugh when you see these cause you're gonna be like, Olivia, where are you going to wear those? But I saw these shoes and the 90s girl in me who grew up reciting lines from Clueless absolutely needed to have these shoes. I mean, a fur heel? Like I'm pretty sure I had these when I was four or five, but they were plastic and I would wear them around the house. They are so cool. I just needed to own these. <laughs> and I'll definitely wear them out like for a girl's night, for date night, for Valentine's day. They also come in like a burgundy red color and the heel is really cute. Like I just, <laughs> these are super cool. I didn't realize how many pairs of shoes I got. I have two more and then I'm done with this haul. I've seen these shoes, like this trend, as well and i've seen them in red too but these are these pointed toe flats with the big buckle like slingbacks just so chic and really stylish again with a wide leg pant these look really great on or with a skirt but i think these are a fun way to like dress up your jeans like i could throw this on with what i have on right now and it would make it look so much more fashionable and like put together but it's just like a really fun different shoe this is another one that i feel like i would wear back in high school and just obsessed. All right, and the last ones, oh, some big ones. These are super, super cool. You, I hope, I'm hoping you're feeling my excitement through the screen because I just found so much good stuff. Look how fun these are. Oh my goodness, that heel is pretty high, but I'm obsessed with this style. I know it's not for everyone, but I saw it and was like, 
I have to have those. Those are so cute. Can you believe like that these are Walmart? Walmart has so many cute, trendy items, like amazing. And again, quick shipping, which makes all of the difference, especially when you're stocking up for a whole season like this. But I'm obsessed with these tall boots. They were like one of the items that I was like, I have to have my hands on those. I have to have those in my closet. They are just so chic. Like pairing these with that skirt is going to be, the short skirt is going to be so cool. I'm oh, obsessed. I know I probably said that like a million times in this video, I apologize. But okay, so that's everything from the Walmart haul. Like I said, go to my Instagram to see the reel I make that shows all the outfits I put together with these pieces. I am super excited about all of them and I will have everything linked in the description box down below. Be sure to check out Walmart for fashion, beauty, back to school, holiday, you name it. They have everything you need with super quick same day delivery or next day delivery, depending on your needs. So now since Lola was really wanting to see me, I'm going to go check on her and see what the babies allow us to do for the rest of the day. And I'll bring you along as much as I can. <sighs> My hair's kind of a mess because I've been running around, but the girls are down for a nap. I am currently packing. I've got like chaos all around me always. So in two days, we are going to Austin to see my in-laws down there. I always pack for me and all the kids. So that's what I'm doing right now. But I wanted to show you guys these really cool packing cubes I got because they're space saving packing cubes. It's like those vacuum seal bags kind of, you know, that like help you save space. I had most of the boys stuff set aside and picked out for a while. When we were in Ohio, we basically are doing back-to-back -back trips. We came back from Ohio and then like two weeks later, we're leaving to go down to Texas. So I tried to just like do laundry and like reuse some of those outfits and essentially move it from one suitcase, wash, clean, reorganize, move it back into the same suitcase. But so these packing cubes, anyways, you can fill them like that, obviously, if you like so. But then there's this second layer right there that helps you tighten it all and take the air out of it and it makes everything so much smaller now i will say it's easy to overstuff these and then you can't get the second zipper closed but when you are fitting a family of you know five and six in one suitcase these help so much because look how sleek that made it with just like these are all of arlo's clothes for our five day trip not his pajamas or underwear, but these are all his clothes <laughs> for our five day trip. And it's like much more sleek in comparison to this is Christian's bag, which is how a normal packing cube would work, you know, like a big square like that. This is what it looks like with all the space saving. So that's pretty cool. So I wanted to show you guys those because I think that it's just the coolest thing. It actually helped so much on this last trip. So. We were gone for 10 days and I'm a classic overpacker anyways. And I packed our suitcase with literally like 72 pounds worth of things. I had to pay extra and take stuff out and all this stuff. But the fact that even 72 pounds fit inside our big suitcase is because of these. I'm going to go to pick up in a little bit, run to UPS on the way, and then I'm gonna come home and work out. So anyways, after we go to this wedding in September, we will be done with travel for a while. And I'm very happy about that. I feel like we didn't travel like at all, obviously since the girls were born. And then we had a bunch of back-to-back -back trips at the end of summer and it's made us all a little crazy, but it's been good, you know, but it's just been hectic. And like to take the boys out of school, their first week of school is not ideal, but um, we are going down for some family stuff. And so it's important that we go and go right now. But yeah, it's just a busy time. <laughs> and then when we get back from this trip in August, Soleil has a surgery scheduled a couple weeks after that. Um, she is gonna get like tubes in her ear just for like, she's got fluid in there and stuff. It's pretty common. And then they're gonna do some scopes while she's under to hopefully give us a better idea of what we're working with, with her overall like medical and health plan. Um, because we really don't know a lot about like our long-term plan. So I'll share more about that when the time comes, but it's just like August has been really busy. September will be really busy and then it'll be a little bit quiet right as we're settling into fall, which will be really nice. So. Now that I've got these all packed up, they also have these handles, which is nice. Now that I've got these all packed up, I'm gonna go get the boys from school and we'll hang out, see what we do. 
practice. Okay, your ball. Three. We're after school now. We're doing our backyard hang. The weather. And water balloons. <laughs> Arlo wants to do water balloons. So water balloons. We may do that. No, Soleil. Soleil's here too. <laughs> We've got kids all around. This is why it's a little hard for me to vlog usually because when I have my kids around, I'm like this with multiple kids. The babies don't have clothes on. It's just. Yeah, they only got a diaper. Yeah, they only got a diaper. How was your day today, Arlo? Good. What'd you do today? I got a as gold. You did get a good as gold. Did you learn anything? Um, I learned. Soleil. Soleil. No. Here's a sneak peek of the reel I'm about to film. These are those boots. I love them. This is just the first outfit, but I wanted to give you guys a bit of a sneak peek for how they're gonna come together, it's so cute. All right, my reel is filmed. I was thinking I would have a little bit more time to relax before getting the boys, but then Lola, of course, woke up for a nap, from her nap, a little bit early, but that's okay. On the way to go pick up the boys from school right now, and then we have Soleil's physical therapy this afternoon, and then I'm hoping that Arlo and Maybe all four, we'll see. I'm hoping that we can get at least three, if not four of the kids napping after that appointment. Arlo's like somewhat on the verge of cutting out naps. Going to school, he's had to cut them out, but he would have, he would take them otherwise. He kind of needs them. So yeah, we've got a busy day. I'm still wearing the black t-shirt from Walmart. I swear every single pair of shoes I got, I was shocked how comfortable they were. <laughs> I was wearing those tall black boots just like around the house to try and grab Lola from her nap because she got up when I wasn't expecting it. And I was like, man, I would have worn these in my retail days. Like, <sighs> the cowboy boots? Oh, but okay, yeah. Time to go get the boys and then back to the normal routine. Arlo, get in your seat, buddy. Can't pull it far. I'll help you. Thank you. Okay, Arlo, can you get in your seat? No, this is a fun story. That's a good food. Currently in the backyard again doing our after school backyard hangs yet again. I feel like this vlog is very representative of my daily life because it is the exact same every day at this moment. That was good, babe. Good job. Tomorrow we fly to Texas, so we have a long night ahead of packing and getting ready. We fly out in the morning, so we need to be ready to go like first thing because it always takes forever for our family to get out of the house. I want to say I'll see if I vlog while we're there, but to be honest, I probably know we won't. I were there for family stuff, and when we went to Ohio, I totally thought I would vlog the trip while we were there. And once we were there, it was just like so busy, go, 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 and we really wanted to spend time with family, and it was just lots of good, like chill, focused time. I feel like we really need that right now. No. Duty calls, this is awesome. I can't often vlog. So I'm gonna let this be it for the video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll try and be back really soon with more updates and fall stuff. You can find me on Instagram in the meantime. I'm definitely more frequently over there these days just because it's a little easier as you can tell with everything we have going on. But thank you guys for watching and for your patience as always. I really appreciate it and I will see you in the next video. Bye.